Welcome to the Poor Man's Gourmet Kitchen, where we share gourmet recipes at a low budget wonder. Now check this out. First thing we want to do is rinse these clams off, okay? As you can see, I've got them buried in ice just to keep them nice and cool and fresh so none of them are dying on me. And then you just want to sort through them here and clean them up a bit, make sure they don't have any sand or soot or any grime on there that make it unpleasant to eat. Then we can add them to a rolling boil. I've got about an inch of water in here. That's all you need to get the steam on and cook these clams. And we'll just put a lid on it. Wait three to four minutes is all it's going to take to get these things to start popping open on their own. As you can see here, the top layer of clams has opened. So we'll start to remove each one individually here with some tongs and separate them from the ones that are unopened. And we'll work our way to the bottom to those. As you can see, they're not fully open. All we do is toss them over, flip them upside down, get a full cook on the other side, and it'll start to open up. See that one in the back just popped right open for us. Perfect. We'll take that one out and move on to the rest. Again, just toss and turn until they open up on you. Just takes a few more seconds. There's another one. I'll pull that one out and then we'll move on to the next stage. Now what you want to do is taste it. That's why I'm dipping a spoon in here. Right there it lets you know how salty that water is. This is what we're going to use to season the clams. Throw in a little cube of butter there. I've got a, probably about two tablespoons worth and some garlic here. I'm going to add to season and flavor this water. Now if it's too salty, all you got to do is just add a little bit more water to it. Okay. Now we're going to add some scallions. That'll help season it more like a, a soup flavor because onions is just good in just about anything. Give it a good stir. Wait for it to melt down. Season a little bit here with a little bit of pepper. Uh, I'm actually going to go ahead and splash in a little bit of cayenne here because I like a little kick. You can use paprika or even uh, some of the most chili flakes are pretty good to use too. But that's up to you. Put in some olive oil and uh, we'll bring the clams over and we'll pour this salsa over the whole top of it. That's what they call it a salsa, by the way. So we're just going to drown them here with that so they all get soaked up and then we'll replate them over here so we can serve them up to eat, okay? And that's all there is to it. That's how to do steamed clams right here in the poor man's gourmet kitchen. Little parsley. <laughs> Good looking. Thank you for watching and be sure to stop by poormansgourmetkitchen.com for more recipes and exact ingredients. 